Hi everyone, I'm Grattles, and welcome to a new episode of City Skylines. This is New Brighton, and in the last episode, we put in the Industries DLC farming over in this area. We started to convert our industry base game to the industry DLC. We added a little bit more residential down here, which we didn't zone in yet. And we did add a little bit more residents down in this area. So I think in today's episode, we're going to put in a new residential area, probably down in here. I want to keep it a little separated. And um, yeah, let's see where we're at. Let's start the game on one speed. We do have a high demand for uh, residents as well as commercial. Just a little bit of industry. Um, let's see where our industry is here. So we should be leveling up soon in this. So let's go ahead and start building off with, I guess, a four lane. Um, let's come down in here. We'll come out this way. I'm not sure how far we'll go. Maybe we'll stop it right there. Just for now. And let's go ahead and start building in some residence. We want to keep this off by one and one. So I guess we'll come in about here. We'll kind of draw in, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. We'll come in by five. And we'll come down. And in this area, we'll just come in. Um, maybe we'll do the same about here. We'll come in by 12. Come into here. And that gives us kind of a rough idea about where we're going. Maybe we'll come down. about there and let's see I don't want to do it completely gridded but I do want to at least grid in probably the first little bit like that and then this maybe we will come down Maybe this way. Okay, our industry did level up. We have the lemonade factory, the uh, milking parlor, the medium crop field, and the medium fruit field. So let's just get out of here a second. Let's, let's go address that. So we can't put in the lemonade stand because we need plastics. And we don't get that until we open up other industry forms. But we can do the milking parlor. And we can do the other fields. So let's look into um, the milking parlor. Let's take a look at that. This is the milking parlor. Let's go ahead and upgrade some of these roads in here. So we'll grab our industry roads. I think we'll upgrade two of these. I'm not going to upgrade this one. because I'm actually going to delete this. And I'm going to delete this one. And let's go ahead and put the milking parlor. I believe it does have polluting. Um... 
Let's go ahead and put that. I think we'll do two right in there. And let's go ahead and draw in another road. And we'll come really close to this guy. I think we just deleted this, but that's okay. I just want to come down like that. And then we'll come across. And I think we'll do some medium fields in here. So let's go to these first. Let me just adjust this one because I want to leave a space in between the two like that. Then I think we'll come down and we'll do the fruit fields. But let's go ahead and draw a road right from here through, which would have worked. I did not think it would fit, but it's the large ones that I think are a lot bigger so let's go back into this and we'll put in some fruit fields let's upgrade this road here okay I don't know why it's saying, oh, we don't have enough money. <laughs> that would make sense. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and fill in our residence here. So let's do somebody around here. And I think we'll go into here. I'm going to keep it off of that road. We're going to come down to here. I think we're going to keep this clean. And we'll keep that. We'll come over to here. And we'll fill in to there. And we'll do that. And maybe that. I'm thinking... Hmm. Let me see. Down in here, I was wondering if we wanted to try something a little different. That is not the right road. So let's come up about half. And... Let's go ahead and see if we can curve this. And make like a little cul-de-sac there. And let's go ahead and fill that in. Let's go fill this first. We'll just do that. Actually, you know what? Let's leave that open in case we want to do something in there. I don't think so, but we'll see. We'll do that, that, and that. There we go. And let's fill in these guys. Actually, let's select this one. There's that, and then we'll fill. And we have like a little cul-de-sac there. Uh, maybe we'll add a little tree in the middle.
Oh, maybe a bigger one. And then maybe, can we place a couple of little ones in between here? I don't like that. Maybe we'll do the colored trees. The pink or purple ones. There we go. We'll do something like that. And let's go ahead and turn this clock back on. We'll go to three speed because we do need to build up some money and we need these residents to move in. Let's come back down in here. All right, they are filling in quite nicely. Let's come back into here. Before we fill out any more, let's go ahead and delete the rocks. There's quite a few rocks in here. Okay, so these guys need water. Let's go fix them. And just bring this water down and straight. There we go. Alright, so we have a decent amount of water ran for our new residents over here. We are starting to see some garbage issues. I don't understand why exactly, but let's see. Um, maybe we could run just a gravel road. Oh, he's full. That is why. Let's go ahead and see what we have available here. So he is full. We don't have the incinerator plant yet. That comes up at 7,000, I think, which is coming up soon. But we do have collapse, so we'll just stick in another one. We'll just collapse the other one later on. We don't even have to do it now. I'm just gonna shut it off. Or I think it's, you know what? That is not shutting it off. That is emptying it. Um, doo -doo -doo. How do I shut this off? There we go. I forgot for a second. Alright, so that's done. Alright, so now that we did that... Uh, let's come back into our roads and start um, curving this. Let's come down. I don't want to go too close, but I want to take this one and curve it. Somewhat like that. Because I do want to fix this area. But I don't like this. This should be... Whoa. And I almost did it again. I'm going to just come off of here and delete that. We still have it on curve. Let's 
come out straight. Actually, that isn't bad. Coming straight. So we'll do that like that. And this will clean up a lot. Because this is kind of a mess. I'm not going to build anything off of this edge. That is just kind of like a marker. We'll kind of run that in straight. And I think what we'll do is we'll come in. We'll do some curved roads. And then we'll do some straight. Do something a little bit tighter there. Maybe we'll come in just by that. We'll come out by three. We'll come to the edge here. We'll come into here. to this area here. Come over to here and I think we'll curve That into there. And we'll do that. Something like that. And we'll do that. Alright, so we have a little bit of a different kind of feel to it. Do something off the edge here. Like that. And we definitely are leaving a lot more space. We're not coming super close and keeping them tightly gridded, which is something I wanted to make sure I didn't do in this one. Um, even when I do the grids, I do kind of want to keep the spaces between them just a little bit. And we'll come down to here. All right. So I think in this area, I'm going to do mostly... A fill so let's go ahead in here and we will go to our medium I think that would be our best bet but before we start doing that let's kind of feel out the middle and put in some schools so let's go to education and let's go ahead and figure out where we would like to put either the big high school or one of these high schools uh, maybe down in here we can do the high school maybe an elementary school in here um, Maybe a park in here. And 
that'll give us pretty good coverage in there. Um, we do need a medical. Let's see what we got with our medical here. We don't have any elder care, and we don't have any child care. I'm thinking the elder care might do well right off this main area here or right here. I think I'll do the elder care there. Gives pretty good coverage over there. Child care. I'm going to come in further. I might actually knock these two guys out. And put it right in the middle. I think that's the best coverage for the child care here. And I just do want to dezone this. And I just dezoned way too much. Because I had it on the medium. So let's fix that. Um, this guy... Do I want to... Yeah, we'll keep him. Alright, we'll keep you there. Um, let me make sure I didn't dezone anything else. I don't think so. Okay, so we have some child care and we have some elder care. So that's, that's pretty decent over here. This, I would have liked to moved it in further to kind of cover that blue... That would have covered our blue section a little bit more. Um, down in here, we kind of cut off access to everybody up there. So I might move him. Just because it will be more practical. And we could always add a little bit of um, commercial down in there. But I'm thinking he might be better off right in the center here buy our child care we will knock out those houses mm, I'm okay with it I, I'd rather have them nicely censor centered right there and let's just cut off a bit of this and this you know what I'm going to keep this off and I'm actually going to keep this off I'm gonna get that off of there and even though this is I might do hmm, they have a pretty nice fenced in yard there so I think we'll keep him let's come back over to here over here we could definitely decorate more we could add more outdoor and park like feel over here with the gazebos and stuff maybe fence this in um yeah i think we'll do that so we'll keep the elder care and child care there let's come on over back to our new residential area um let's see we do need to put in more medical over here um we do have two different medical clinics we don't have a crematorium, but we do have the community pool now. Now, I'm thinking maybe a community pool would be good off in this area. Right now, we don't have enough money. We're going to turn our game back on. How much is that? 75000 so that might be a little bit out of our budget for now. Let's go ahead and just get a regular clinic. Maybe a little bit different. Um, be right in here. This will kind of be like a little hub in here of all the stuff. Um, we do want to put a different district on here. So let's do that.
Okay, so let's go ahead and district this a little bit different. And we'll go here. And why don't we use European Suburbia? I think we'll do that. And let's see. All right, let's go ahead and fill this out. We need some residents badly. So let's go into, we'll just do the small fill for now. We'll just come along here. I do want to come down here. And I think we're going to come down into this area. And we'll grab right along here because we do need the electric. So let's go over here. Let's take this off. I don't want this to build in here. And I honestly do not want them on the edge here. On the edge here is fine. On the edge here is not. So they're going to get dezoned. Sorry, guys. Uh, this is okay. This we want off. I mean, these fills are really nice because you can fill a larger area. But if you want to go for a little more detail, then you do want to take off some of these edges. Over in here. That's for the other side. So let's see where we can put a little commercial down in here. Let's use the fill tool, actually. Nope. Let's use the select tool. All right, so I'm going to add a little commercial in here. And this way I can stretch the electric. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, our industry leveled up. And we got a couple of more buildings. So we'll address that in a second. We do want to get this electric taken care of. So let's see if I have a demand here. Why don't we see if we can add just one building here and maybe one over here. And we can technically run the electric from there. So that one should fill out in a minute. And then we'll get all these people taken care of with the electric. We could run it right from here to there. That'll work. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead and complete filling out some more of this area. I think I'm going to keep it on the select tool for now, to be honest. It just is better. So I don't get crazy. Or we'll go to the fill tool. That's fine too. Until we get to certain areas like that. Um, select. We'll do that. And I don't want to overfill because we don't have a huge demand for residential anymore but we do have a pretty big demand for some commercial I'm just gonna fill in a little bit of that so okay so we hit our milestone let's go ahead and pause the game let's go check that out all right, so we did get a new area, and now we have campus areas. So I definitely want to open up some university, and I definitely want to use the uh, university DLC. So we'll definitely do that. So we got high density now, and yeah, we got quite a bit of stuff here. So we have metro stations and 
yeah so I think overall we did get this in pretty well we addressed the need for more residents I do like I said want to keep it a little bit stretched and then leave this area open a little bit more and then spread spread out our residents a little bit better so everything's not so tight and eventually we'll start curving in and making you know smaller residential areas almost connecting them to but not so dense um, so yeah I think we're gonna leave this episode off here and in the next episode since we do have a good amount here of um, residents we can definitely upgrade some more of this industry in here because we hit that milestone as well and maybe in here we can do some kind of university uh, so we don't have residents in here so we do have farm but we have farm already over here so I don't want to put another farming area right on top of it maybe we'll use a little bit of that down there or even over there but we definitely don't need this so I think this would make a great university area I think it's it's not central but it's it's fine to use because we're only going one square out that way and it's in the center of the others so I think that would make a really good university so we'll use the campus DLC and we'll start making some money we're up to making 15,000 now so we are definitely making money so yeah um, I might delete this until we need it why pay maintenance on roads we don't need um, so definitely we'll next episode campus upgrade this industry fill in some of the milestones we got maybe put in our post office and maybe our downtown a little bit so we have a lot of things to look forward to so I'm gonna leave this episode off here again and uh, if you like my content please like subscribe comment let me know what you'd like to see let me know how I'm doing um, and I will see you soon thanks bye